We just discussed this. No, I thought she became like. Oh, a, oh, I see what you mean. No, this is not the. This is not the uh, wife. Well, if you remember any Miller Fillmore. Oh, that's a Benjamin. Do you have change for a hundred? Uh, I know it's kind of awkward, but. Can I use the bathroom? <laughs> oh, I never mind. He's having an asthma attack. Well, what is he clutching? Maybe it's diabetic. Maybe he's looking for insulin. Oh, it is asthma. A couple more hits. <laughs> okay, so it was asthma. I was right. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> what is it? What do you want, asshole? Water. I'm getting low life. Fuck. Stop being a loser. It. Oh, that was a little sensual there for a minute, though. <laughs> oh, that is... Oh, this is what I paid for. I'm like concentrating so hard on this. I'm not used to doing these with WASD and a mouse. Oh, get his ass. Who is this guy? <laughs> takes place in the U.S. Still 
Reggel is vettem. Uh, I mean, maybe she was being honest when she said she literally had nothing else to sell. Yeah, but like if you don't have the information, you don't have the information. I like how he gets these close ups. You can see his shaven face and all the pores on it. While it loads. I forget how he shaved his face. I mean he might have shaved it. Look at you can see where I messed up and you can see the scar where his uh <laughs> On his right cheek. So I think we all need to get this. This looks like his ad. You can tell because he looks oblivious to what's going on around him. No, it's just his face. It's his face and face. Gotcha. What's the problem? I don't know. I'm just waiting for it to load so I don't have to get too sensual with it. Zero point six eight inches. Good. Yeah, he's he's getting a little chub going now. Because it's called heavy rain, it's also supposed to be dramatic. Film noir. Except it's not noir. Also, this must be my car because he's clearly shaking because uh it's cold because the heating doesn't work and also the windfields. Uh, windshield wipers aren't doing anything. What is that vial? Well, I mean, yeah, but I mean, is it the kind that gets you hired? Is it the kind that turns you into a superhuman, or? Gotcha. Is this another investigator? He looks high. out a gun. <laughs> it's just, it just, uh, it just uh, says I can do whatever the fuck I want. <laughs> can I have one of those ponchos? It's, it's raining really hard. So what is this, another victim of the I wanted to say Zodiac Killer, but I guess it's origami, isn't it? Aw, oh, damn! What is this? Why don't I have these glasses? So this takes place in 2011. Should I be taking these off? Yeah, I figured. What is this? No, I don't want to get rid of that. Bro, they did not have this shit in 2011. Is this AR type stuff? His credit card number? Basically, you have to use Witcher Sense. Yeah. I probably shouldn't be looking for where, for what the cops are already looking at. Oh, I could have asked him if he knew where Blake, Lieutenant Blake was.
just how investigations are done in this game. I mean, he probably doesn't have the authority. pretty easily if that were the case, right? Sons for a scoop. so I can follow the trail now. I think. Well, um, time cards are just really far back. Probably the next day. Ah, shit, a train's coming. <laughs> Boss, Lieutenant, you ever see Stand By Me? Tech to solve this case in 2011. Is that the end of my lead? <laughs> is that a, is that an option? <laughs> another another week, dead week. <laughs> Uh, uh, as you can see from the character, I, I have a automatic, uh, facial expression recognition. However, it doesn't seem to be working perfectly well. Thanks, Metman. I said, uh, I'm still, I, I have to like automatically do it myself the way, um, the, the face recognition works. So I have to like make a face into kind of a, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? I mean, correlate to my face, right? Sync it to my face. So, it, it's a little too sensitive if you can't tell. So I'm like, I'm gonna try it out today. But if it like, if it doesn't work, like I'm not making that face. But either way, uh, Gabe is not here for heavy rain. As much as I would like to get back into it, um, 
so instead I decided to, I, I, I got a little, my hands on some cash. I was going around this week while it was like dead week, uh, like doing some PC repair, and uh, for it, uh, all around the place. And so I was able to kind of cop myself, uh, Hitman 3, I suppose, which the reason I wanted to pick this up, cause it made me think, all right, I like stealth games. They're really funny and I'm really bad at them. <laughs> so we're going to see how that works. Of course, the game is gigantic, so I had to, like Heavy Rain, I had to put it onto my hard drive instead of my SSD, so we'll see how long it takes for a game like this to load up on a hard drive. I don't think it should be, I mean, if I can, I mean, it shouldn't be too, like, demanding for me to run on stream, right? Again, I could have checked it, but... Yeah, um... I heard you can import from Hitman 1 and 2 into Hitman 3, which would be pretty cool, which is why I was willing to put down the money for it. Oh, it, For some reason, it's trying to like load in on my th third display for some reason. I like how it still counts as me getting a follower, even though we banned him. <laughs> okay, so yeah, it's for some reason it's in a really tiny letterbox on my other display, so... HDR, ray tracing, wow, you can do a lot with this. Motion blur's off by default, that's always good. How sh should I check to see, like, what are the system requirements for this? I know I beat him. I just don't know. Watch it be uh, an i5-2500K. I'm, I'm hoping that I can even stream this, honestly, after, especially after I hyped it up. Oh, my God. Yeah, I don't get a, I, I got a way more when uh, I first started streaming. I'll get so excited, like, oh, someone's here. You know, first time streaming, it's like, no, it's just another bot. All right, so let's see how this runs on. See, the funny thing is, like most games that I play on stream, I'm going into this effect al almost completely uh, blind. I know enough about it that I was willing to make a purchase on it, but I've never actually, like, like you know, I've never looked at a walkthrough. It's like Heavy Rain, right? Like, I'm basically going in blind. Uh, no, thank you. I have a stream for that. Yeah, yeah, you can have my firstborn. But I'm going to name it Eugene for when you take it. Subtitles on. Yeah, 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 that's fine. I don't have any Hitman 2 progression. So, okay, okay, okay. Let's just do the... I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and do the tutorial here, because I'm not going to pretend like I can just go in. Like, it has to be a disaster, but it has to be a controlled disaster, you know what I mean? I have to know what I'm supposed to do and then mess it up, not mess up because I don't know what to do. That's not as fun, right? Not to mention, we're still going to try and see how this runs. Damn, I wasn't even born yet when 47 was doing his first mission. Oh, of course, absolutely. Okay, it looks like it's running alright. I think it's go it's good on the stream. I can not I can never tell because it's always uh, displayed at a lower frame rate anyway on the OBS uh, overlay. But it's running perfectly on my game, on my end. It actually does look really nice, too. Gotta go into a short jog. It's all cold out. I've been feeling that ever since it's been getting cold. My car doesn't have heating anymore. So... I'm Diana. I'll take you to your quarters. Someone likes to keep secrets. 
Secrets are our stock and trade. Besides, from what I hear, you have a few of your own. I'm not like you, in case you're wondering. I'm in the handler program. Mm. Agents and handlers work in unity. You know the expression. No Am I like a dog? Well, that part is my job. No, your enemies only have the victory. I know. You also need to know yourself. I'm working on it. I always thought that 47 was a mute for some reason. I guess that doesn't do very good for espionage. Tell me, what did it feel like? Taking lives. Random. Disordered. Ooh. Is that why you came here? Why you let us test you? Maybe I'm not the only one being tested. Okay, you mind elaborating a little bit, 47? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so training starts at 0600 hours. I should... Leave you to prepare. Gotta say, 47's jawline. I know, like, it's been a case that the first thing I do every time I play a new game sure is comment on the protagonist, but... <laughs> there are no second chances, Miss Burnwood. Not here. I choose him. May I inquire why? A blank slate? Antisocial? Apathetic and unresponsive? No doubt the boy shows promise, but... Perhaps I see a possibility where others see limitation. Isn't that what a handler does, sir? We'll see. Anyone can kill Miss Burnwood. He still remembers nothing. But only I can do it while also promoting the best damn razors that you'll ever meet. See. In the meantime, keep him under close watch. Look at all these. Every time I turn my head, I can see like all the emotions flipping around. I might have to quit that out. I'm also really worried about what alt tabbing this game is like. Welcome to Advanced Mission Training. This operation originally took place in Sydney. The target was Calvin Ritter, infamous cat burglar, also known as the Sparrow. You will need to infiltrate the yacht, isolate and eliminate... Right, some one of us has to show emotion, right? 47 looks like... And remember, he, he just watched his dog, like, piss on the rug. ...in any room, but blunt force will get you nowhere in this business. And a true assassin never calls attention to himself. Good luck, initiate. What if I really want to tell them about my live stream? All right. As previous tests have established, you exhibit an unusual level of enhanced uh, sense of perception. You Use your instinct now to sense the position and movement of people around you and identify your target. Okay. Oh, control. There he is. Yeah, that's that's definitely a way to put it. So I can't go through there. I mean, I could, but with this little thing called a handgun. But I mean, talk about brute force. Okay, okay, okay. Hold on. Do I have to like look at him? Yeah, I do. Right. Good evening, officers. As suspected, security won't allow you on board in your current outfits. We should avoid confrontation and look for another way in. X of all? That's a weird way to do it. That mechanic is in your way. Sneak up and subdue with Q. Subdue him quietly. Oh, I have to keep pressing it. It's one of those kind of games, like Heavy Rain. Damn, how do you do this in a, like on a controller? That's a first. Might just work though. People do tend to see uniforms, not faces. Be cautious though. Some people are more observant than others. Not bad initiate. <laughs> okay, so I'm I'm doing like. It feels like I'm doing like twister with my fingers. What toilet? Wait, I'm gonna drag him onto the toilet? Or no, I can go in here, okay. Good thing they just left this empty, and of course he can stand on his own, even though he's unconscious. Yeah, that's fine.
Okay, well that's pretty useful if it's save and load. That way I can mess up whenever, as long as I'm saving. I hope there's like a hockey for it too. Hello, yes, it is me. Threat icon will find you suspicious. Okay. Hold on. That mechanic with his back turned? He's what we call an enforcer. He knows his crew and he'll see right through your disguise. So stay out of his line of sight. Morning, Jim. Right. Now for the tricky part. Start by locating your target. Intel suggests he's around the bar area. You're in. Well done, initiative. I mean, after all of this, you couldn't get me a ticket into the club to make this a little bit easier. Grease. That is your target. Fortunately, the place is crawling with witnesses. I suggest you follow him. See if you can't isolate him. Long, if not longer, but had no way to save or check. Yeah, old. Uh, it's not... I'm doing my job. I'm his. Yes, sir. Private deck is off limits for mechanics. If assimilation is the name of your game, you'll need a better disguise. All right, so let's find somebody who's a. Uh... Oh, it's yeah. Okay, so it's gonna tell me to. I know karate. <laughs> yeah, you know karate, do you? <laughs> I would hope so. All right. Okay. Let me pick up the wrench again while I'm in. The cabin crew is allowed upstairs access. A bit. Can I put this away? Very unorthodox. How do I? I... Here, I'll just throw it away. Yeah. I'm sure the guys who literally just saw me a minute ago won't recognize anything. Okay. Morning off. After evening, officer. I'd make a great assassin. Now we get it. Ah, but according to Intel, Ritter is another enforcer who picks his own cabin. So tread carefully. Wait, what's searching? Oh, they oh they found the body. Or they found Okay, uh Greetings, Mariner. Hello. I was just seeing what's happening. Good evening. Oh my god, glad I'm not those guys. The target will spot you if you get too close. To eavesdrop on his conversation, try and find a way to blend in. Back already? Buddy, making a slip. I make a mean bloody Mary. Well done, initiate. There's not a lot of socializing going on at this party. I hope they stop that guy. I feel like this is a good time to save. I can already see something going wrong. See, I may be bad at this, but I'm also good at uh, no, I'm very self-aware. So he's talking to the dude. They're all stressed out. Maybe he'll go hide in his private cabin. Can I get you a drink, sir? We've got uh, we got a, a single can of opened uh, beer. We've got uh, what does that say? I can't quite read it. I think it's French. Yeah, one warm course ride that's been sitting on this table for the entire night. Uh, we got some cigarette butts. No, I understand. So good of you to fly down. Can I offer you a drink? Oh, no, thank you. No, uh, not before six. My wife is very insistent about that move. My sympathies. So, excellent timing. I just had to I just think he is too polite to say he doesn't want the, uh, he doesn't want the open. Hand. 
Fisher is about to have a private meeting with the gentleman in white. This could be useful. He is getting his drink whether he likes it or not. Oh, I just have a. Oh, I need a lockpick. Okay. Ah, if only there was another way in. What was that look? <laughs> now is your chance. Use your silent pistol. The client will notice. Ooh, I have certain items are considered illegal depending on your current outfit. Avoid suspicion by concealing it. Okay, cannot be. Alright, so how do I put away my, uh... Be advised or, RCA clients rely on our discretion and here, can I hide this now? How do I like disarm myself? I want to put the weapon on. Oh yeah, I want to. I want to be Mr. Ritter's. This isn't Mr. Ritter's. Uh, Mr. Ritter's is the other guy, isn't he? Can I not disguise? Okay, I can. Oh man, at least he died in a dignified way. I had to put the gun away. I don't think fiber wire is any less suspicious if we're being completely honest. Huh? Can they see him? He's just taking a quick, uh... That's a reload. Hold on, where, if I go to options, mouse and keyboard, key bindings, let's see. Holster, H, okay, or mouse button 3, okay, cool. The red car marks your execution. <laughs> Officers? <laughs> Look, these guys deserve it with security like this, man. Uh, how do I get out of here? I, I should just be able to go out through the entryway, right? Have a good night, officers. Stay safe. I look like a pimp. They just found the body right as I'm leaving. And may I say, elegantly done, Initius. Oh my god, don't even get me started on the Video Game Awards. I love the memes that are coming out of it, too. I still don't know what they meant by anything that they said. <laughs> like, you have one chance to go up there, and it had to do with rabbis and Bill Clinton. How did you know? I told you he had talent. His stats are off the charts. I mean, it's it, like, he just walked in there, man. Nobody stopped him. And so if I were there, I'd be like, well, no one else is making a big deal out of this, so they must know more than I do. Power like that, with no moral restraint, he could be dangerous. I thought that was rather the point. I was about to say. have weak spots, Miss Burton. And he happens to have a very large bald spot. Check. But this one... Perhaps it would be better to just... Give me a chance, sir. Give him a chance. I will take full responsibility. Yeah, I saw him throw that wrench. Very you know how hard it is to knock somebody out with a wrench by throwing it? Welcome back, Initiate. 
As an ICA agent, every challenge you face can be overcome in multiple ways. Wait, what? Am I doing this again? This time from a different angle. Okay. Before the final test, you're allowed more time to practice the Ritter operation. You're free to choose the approach. Okay, okay. We'll do one. What's this? Board the yacht described as a, I mean, sorry, disguised as a security guard. Eh, you know what? Let's just go to the mission, actually. Yeah, I was about to say, that was a training exercise. Those look like live rounds to me. Those guys, I mean, I hope they had hazard pay at least. Especially if you were uh, one of the targets. He was the boss everyone hated. He must have been a terrible co-worker. Okay, so there's Hitman, Hitman 2, Hitman 3. Yeah, so you can go through like everything basically. Or, well, I have to get access. Okay, let me see how much... Yeah, so you have to have uh, the access pass, which is, yeah, a lot of money. So I just have Hitman 3, that's fine. Agent 47 and Diana Burnwood are the world's top assassins working for the ICA. Unknowingly, they have been hired by a shadow client to target a number of operatives of Providence. A oh yeah. Organization working in the highest echelons of power. Oh, it's a, it's not a place. Providence's controller, the Constant, approaches Diana and makes her a deal: eliminate the shadow client and learn about Forty Seven's past. Why doesn't he just but tell him? Forty Seven discovers that the shadow client is Lucas Gray, his lost childhood friend. He and Diana switch sides to fulfill an old pact: destroy Providence. Together, they managed to capture the huh. Maybe I should have started with one. Of the three Providence partners. Eliminate them, and the war would be over. I'm guessing it's not gonna be that simple. However, the Yeah, there it is. <laughs> Look closer. In the shadows. Behind the everyday world, beyond the headlines and the seats of power. And Who's this? Man. I'm definitely missing something. A kind of company known as Providence. To it, we were just assets. That's how companies tend to work. And throw away. Unfortunately. To do the unthinkable. The unforgivable. And it never gave us a second thought. Mm-hmm. Until now. After oh, we're in Saudi Arabia. We are fighting back. Me. We're right on the border, too. 47. Much has been lost. But we are closer than ever. We trap the constant, Providence's chief controller, and finally learnt the names of its three partners. In their down and we walked the whole way there. We made the past to rest. And just maybe look towards the future. It's honestly hard to tell which one's which. Ah, damn, that is a skyscraper. The partners are down there. You know, I never planned to fly ahead. Good to know. Thanks for easing me in. Wait, is that a beacon? Woo! Well, it did its job. What the hell? Base. Left the car loud, so I have just took off. Confirm target location, Silver. Diana, what's the status? Right. We have a situation. 
Carlisle has left the building. And I think I know why. They know you're there. The Constant has escaped. He persuaded one of the sailors into setting him free. And since then, he's been seizing control of Providence assets and resources. I can only assume Carlisle is rushing to contain the damage. If she slips away again, we'll keep track of her. Make sure she doesn't. If this is something they could have told us before we jumped out of a plane. Your destination is the sector. The world's tallest building. It would kind of suck if we just got chopped up by the helicopter blades. Sheikh Omar Al Ghazali. Marcus Stuyvesant is fifth generation old money. His family made its fortune in real estate and banking, and were at one point the chief landowners in New York. Carl Ingram is a powerful. They had to make point that he's rich. He <laughs> grew rich selling gunpowder during the American Civil War, and later established a globe-spanning empire in oil, coal. And All right, so it's like if Napoleon Bonaparte met uh, J. Rockefeller. Gotcha. Dominance endures to this day. Now, the partners likely suspect that we're coming. So Mr. Gray will infiltrate building controls and disable all electronic doors and elevators. Oh, that's not suspicious. Are about to find they have nowhere left to run. Right. This is our moment, 47. Providence ruined our lives with the flick of a pen. Today, we return the favor. By ruining their lives with the flick of a pen? Can I kill him with a pen? We get some irony. All right, Ingram and Marcus. Uh, I can't say his whole, see his whole name. All right, cool. Okay, so I get to do I get to choose my own? Okay. Smuggled item. Okay, so I can't do anything. So they're really starting me off with nothing, which I guess that's fine. Fiber wire. Wow, they're really starting me off with like nothing. God, why does that guy just look like James Woods in a way, and the other one just looks like Johnny Cage? <laughs> Welcome to Dubai. Yeah, I mean, I guess it would be safe to assume it's Dubai. They really want to make make it look like it's the skyscraper. <laughs> you know what I like about this place? It's very modest. Right. While a paranoid Carl Ingram has ensconced himself in his penthouse suite, security on highest alert. With suspicion number one. Mr. Gray is already in position and ready to assist. Good luck, 47. 47. Come in, 47. Do you copy? I'm here. Are you in position? I'm heading towards the point of entry. Good. Get back to me when you're there. Okay, so can I climb up here? No? Okay. Uh, this way? Okay, yeah. Whew! Like, they, it's the first mission, and they're starting me off like, okay, first you're going to get a little ship, we're going to tell you everything you need to know. So like, okay, by the way, now that you're out of training, uh, everything, oh, is 10 trillion feet above the ground. And they are on high alert, because they basically know you're coming. Ooh, with that upper body workout. Oh my god. No, I don't want to climb. I want to hang and scale. Can I please get up? Oh, I have to hold up. Okay. Hmm, locked. Forty-seven. Use your camera and scan the lock, will you? Do I, I have a cam? Whoa, 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 whoa! No, 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 no! Forty-seven. Don't let the intrusive thoughts win. The call of the void. How do I uncrouch? Is it C? It is, okay. Okay! <laughs> I wish I could just be plus to vault, but I understand they also already have that button or something. I'm in position. 47, the inauguration is taking place close by. Once you've infiltrated it, get your bearings. You, you got me there. I did jump right into it, but still. Focus on this one. If Ingram and Stuyvesant are alerted to our presence, we may lose them for good. We are so close, 47. Don't worry. They're not going anywhere. This sounds like it's leading up to, uh, to us losing them very quickly. Can I steal anything here? Nothing? Okay. 
I hope there's somewhere I can get a disguise or something because. Huh. Okay. Uh, save. <laughs> Oh wait, maybe I should take some of the clothing here. Oh, oh, they wanted to do an effect, okay. <laughs> Welcome to the barge Al Ghazali. Thank you, sir. How did you know? I mean, it is very beautiful, but the bloom is a bit much. Can't even see the art installation. Oh yeah, because this doesn't look privileged. Oh, wow. Small loan from his father. I, I see where they're going with that. Very cheeky. Uh, thank you. Uh, Alright, I gotta keep in mind that I can't kill that guy anymore. I gotta keep notes on who and who has not uh, gotten in, who been rude to me. Thank you. I like how he's like, we have to focus, and the first thing I do is I go and enjoy an art installation. But let's just say I'm blending in, right? It's so I could barely see it through the, the lighting. I had a hole in my shoe, now my sock's all wet. So the question is, how am I going to get up to this guy right here? Oh, wait, I can keep moving forward. Okay. Excuse me, ma'am. Wow. Right. Lucy Phillips, she already had a target on her face. I'll get my coat. Well, that was fun. Now, uh, maybe I can grab a drink, eh? Calm the nerves. No? God, there are a lot of people here to see me do some fucked up shit. Excuse the language. It's also really hard to tell what's a door or not. But yeah. I do not want to go through it again. As much as I love art... I would like to address the Providence partners directly. I want them to know why this is happening. And I have an idea, but it requires you finding a map terminal. Uh oh. Map terminal? Okay. Do they, do, do they let me just access those things? Right there. That's Marcus Stites. Providence partner, self entitled, oh. and arrogant little woman. Fair enough. He might not look like much. He's done more damage to the world than you could dream. Really, sir? His escorts with him? What's the update on my new guy? Excuse me. Oh, loud here, you know. my bad. Hey, can you come here for a minute? I need your help. Sir? Hello. To be in here. You have a lot of nerve being alive. Sir, I just told you to move along. Hey, beat it. Come here, I just gotta get to your back real quick. Oh, it's... 
Oh, that's a quick time event. Oh, hi. You're lucky that person is still breathing. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, 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 hey. It's okay. It's okay. I'm surrendering. Okay. Uh Let's uh let's uh, that was that was an issue with the controls. Like I I I I kind of messed up cuz I I saw it said Q but I was pressing E on accident. <laughs> okay, where were we? Oh yeah, it was all just a bad dream. We were just so mesmerized by the art installation that we forgot how to subdue somebody. Alright, let's walk back. He'll give me the whole spiel again. Greetings, sir. Hello. It also doesn't help how I alerted the other guard by, like, going into the wrong area. It's cool to see all the, uh, hot air balloons. Hello. Very antisocial. <laughs> All right, we're getting there. Are you going to tell me about uh, the thing I need to do? But I have forty-seven. I need you to find a McDonald's. Forty-seven. There he is. I would like to address the Providence Partners directly. I want them to know why this is happening. And I have an idea, but it requires you finding a map terminal. Uh -huh. Ooh, what's this all about? I've been personally invited by the Royal Highness Omar Al Ghazali. I should have clearance. The name is Zayna Kazim. Sir, I understand. But you can't enter without being searched. Standard procedure. This is ridiculous. Zana Kazim, aka. Oh, Vulture. I see. One of the top agents working for Crystal Dawn, the Pan African Terrorist Organization. Oh, great. I'm glad I they invited him. I myself once, but chose the Maelstrom instead. Now, what is his business here? Well, that's how it is. Think about it and come back if you want. I'll be waiting upstairs in the reception. Do you think they'd care about my wire? Crystal. Uh, am I not supposed Definitely to be? Not true here. Get out of my face. Okay, you're on my shit list. Yeah, it's just a phone charger. I, I was in the war. I have metal platings in my head. Hmm. I don't remember that that's there. So where was I when I saw the dude last time? I see one over there. Where's the other guy? He's up above, right? Because he's hiding, basically. He knows that stuff is going on. Oh, I can disguise myself as him? Mind if I, uh... Ooh, a coin. Can I sit here? Do something worse than blind Oh, gotcha. God, what is your problem? You are sick. You have no idea. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Whoops. <laughs> Ladies, hey guys, watch this. <laughs> listen, 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 listen. I, s I saw there was an auto save.
<laughs> this it really is all about like not letting the thoughts uh, win. If you want to court a woman, you have to get rid of all potential competition. Maybe next time he'll think to put out his cigarette, huh? Ever thought about that? Oh, I just want to push him so damn bad. Don't mind me. Just happened to be going the same area. Oh, what a nice art installation, man. What? What happened? Hey, did you guys hear anything? I have the right to remain silent. I'm not moving. What's that command? Whoa, dude, I saw that. What are you? What? All right, this guy's involved. Uh, <laughs> I I thought I was going to subdue him. I didn't realize uh <laughs> <laughs> that I would just like sucker punch him. <laughs> oh my god, I gotta like. So like, I, like when I when I press Q, I thought it was gonna be like during the simulation where I just like you know choke him out quietly, but <laughs> he just turned and fucking threw a haymaker at him. Made a. <laughs> you know, maybe I'll bring the shovel this time. <laughs> oh no. Listen, this dude has had so many chances to put out the cigarette at this point. Yep, just a lovely day in Dubai, above the clouds. <sighs> How do I grab him again? B. Okay. Who could have done this? I like how punching him makes a lot of noise, but the moment I hit him in the head with a shovel, it's like, no issue there. Excuse me, guards, I, I'm back. I had to go for a quick shave real quick of my entire head. Good to see you. Sir, if you want to come through, I'm going to have to pat you down. Just a quick pat down, sir. Nothing to worry about. Yep. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, I'm so worried about pressing the wrong button and just decking her again. Arrogance can be a dangerous trait. Yes, indeed, it can. Mr. Ingram has been expecting you. We have a conference room set up for you. Perfect. I must look exactly like uh, the guy I just knocked out. I don't even remember his name. All I know is that uh, I should probably have taken his cigarettes too. It seems like that's kind of an issue of his. How you doing? A frisk zone again? I just got past it. Okay, I was about to say, like if I can 
get it through the first set of guards, then you ought to just let me have it at that rate. Hello, yes. I remember you, George. Yeah. Can I grab a coffee? What's up? Yes, hello. Ooh, what's this? Oh, what? Oh my god, I just wanted to open a letter. I'm sending it to my grandmother. Wow. Damn, there is a no tolerance on this shit. <laughs> These guys don't mess around. Alright, don't pick up the letter opener. Understood. Thank you. <laughs> well, I mean, my thing is, like, in Metal Gear, right, like, you could practically blow up a building and people would be like, oh, it must have been the wind. Or I'm sure there was a reason for it. Meanwhile, you know, in this game, it's like, what are you doing with the letter opener? Uh, am I supposed to keep moving? That was probably weird. They're like, why did you just come in and sit down? Wait, what, is, uh, what does it say I have to do in the other room? This isn't suspicious, by the way. I'm just very lost. What's that right there? Is that a Coke? Can I have a drink? Can I do that without being shot at? That'd be, a pr that'd be pretty sick, wouldn't it? Perfect. Oh, I have to wait. I'm alright. How are you? Please make it Mr. Kazim. A pleasure to meet you. There he is. Tells me great things about you. I'll get straight to the point. I have a well, let's call it a There's the pen. Which the Royal Highness tells me you're very capable of taking care of. Now I've worked with your organization before. Morocco, I believe. So I'm a little hesitant. Don't be. We do what's needed. Well, only time will tell. By the way, you've lost your British accent since the last time we talked. the first one, and then we can discuss the bigger fish. Now, on to the first. An acute problem has been brought to my attention. Keep talking. I'll be candid with you. No one is supposed to know that I'm here. However, there's a journalist down at the inauguration, and he's asking rather intrusive questions about who's staying up here, and that is a very dangerous problem for me. I want you to silence this little pain. Ah. You think you can do that? It's what I do best. I like your bluntness. This is his fault. No, they're just cigarettes. He's looked. Pulitzer winning freelance journalist. He's good. And won't give up until he gets the answers he needs. And that can't happen. Ah, so we're the CIA then. And remember, I want a picture. I want proof so I can sleep tonight. Once this little assignment is completed, come back and talk to Miss Toad. Okay. Then we can discuss the real I feel like there's not a lot of... Removed. I'm sure you can Oh, you mean the one in my lungs? Alright, so I guess we're going through this the linear way then. Alright, so we gotta find Hans, which I guess I can... Can I do it with this? Is this him? It's probably just one of the targets, I suppose. Well, I, yeah, I can follow that. Okay, so there is, like, a linear way to do this. You don't have to, like, go all creative, which is fine. Good thing they didn't check up my ass. I mean, hello, officers. Very good to see you. Keep up the good work. Asking these questions, I'll have to contact Central to escort you out. Okay. Mr. Luft, I hear you're looking for information. 
Oh, really? Okay. You know what's happening upstairs? I know more Great. than you can <laughs> But we can't talk here. Follow me. Great. Lead the way. Alright, so where am I heading? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I gotta I gotta take him somewhere where I can knock him out. Well, I mean I'm supposed to kill him, but I mean incapacitate is such a broad word, you know. Was it here where the uh where the closet was? I can't even remember. Oh yeah it was, okay. Wow, I actually kept track of something like spatially in a game. Where are you taking me? Mm. Something big must be going on since you're taking so many precautions. Yeah, yeah. Seriously, how do you know my name? I haven't told anyone who I was. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right, now I gotta take out a camera. <laughs> uh, I can't have him. Can I get you out of here? It's giving me the opportunity to enter, but can I not like? Why can I not get him out? How am I supposed to take a picture of him if he's trapped in here? Ah, I'm sure this will be good enough. Or do I have to press the same button? It was what button was it to drag? I thought it was B, wasn't it? Look, as much as I love your company. Okay, seriously. Am I, like, not able to get this guy out? Oh my god. There's nothing that's working! The worst part is he's not even, like, dead. He's unconscious. He's gonna wake up and wonder what the hell happened. I'm like pressing every button on my keyboard right now. Oh my lord, how am I supposed to take a picture? I guess I could wait for him to wake up? But how long could that be? That was a pretty powerful punch, I suppose, if it knocked him out. I guess what I could technically do if I was... Here, what's my... First off, what's my earliest. Okay, it's when I'm walking him, I think, right? Really hope so. Okay, okay. Yeah, it's right after where I have to act, where I have to locate him. Cool. How are you today? Sir? I'm all right. How are you? Where do I get down again? I like how they just happen to have all these dressers just lying around in the middle of nowhere. Yeah, can you direct me to the letter? What do you want to know about the letter openers? Like, I get you want to be precautious, but my man... Maybe I shouldn't, like, just put him in the closet. I mean, I feel like that's the safest way. I should knock him out, take the picture, and then do it. I was thinking, upstairs. Here, let me save really quick, just so I don't have to do the walk again. I don't know if there's a big deal out of sprinting around when everyone else is like walking, but. You know what's happening upstairs? I know more than you could imagine. But we can't talk here. Follow me. Great. Lead the way. Meanwhile, the other guy's like, wait a minute. <whistles> so, 
So what's the, how do I strangle him instead of decking him as hard as I can? It's, it's funny, but I'm worried that those guys are going to hear me this time. No, there's nothing wrong. What on earth do you think you're doing? God damn it. How did he hear it that time? Did I punch him harder? Yeah, I guess that's true. I gotta have the fiber so that I can choke him out with it. But it's so funny. I'm trying to talk to you, sir. Yeah, but that's where the fun comes in sometimes. Let's see. All these events lately. Yeah, so that didn't work. Uh, I think I just have to use it. I have to like right click and then use it. <laughs> I just, I, I, you're not supposed to punch him with the five or <laughs> whatever. I can't believe he's falling for this again. You could imagine. But we can't talk here. Follow me. Great. Lead the way. I tell you, man, this is the fourth time today I've been led up here, and the first three times I've been punched in the face. <laughs> Put the coconut down, sir. I mean, I guess I understand now. Ooh, I can put on a filter. How do I? Is it gonna let me? Oh, Z X and. Ooh. Ah, this really. You know, we're in an art gallery. How do I move up to the depth of field and everything? It says the middle mouse button, but it's not doing anything. I forget. This is fine. I'm sure no one will see me here. Oh, that's... That's a long way down. God damn it, why is this working? <laughs> What's going on here? What happened? Yeah. Some guy is being a nuisance to everyone. Do we you need have to info stop him. on the first Good job. I don't know. He was white and he's clearly in disguise. Please. I'll let you know if I see him. In the meantime, I could probably use a disguise. Also, saying that he's white doesn't really... Oh, this guy's going to see me. He doesn't know what's going on. Yeah, there we go. Blending in. I can't... Why is this the one that worked, man? I'm not even going to save either, because I'm still, like, overt in a way. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Do you guys see any white guys around? I heard he threw a coconut at a dude. They're still hunting me. <laughs> Taking their picture. News will spread pretty quickly that I didn't actually kill the dude. Hello, sir. Hello, I wanted to go back through the art gallery again. Please, come right in, sir. Yes, thank you. I should have picked the coconut back up afterwards. Okay, I'm going... I should not be in here. But I can't really go back the way I was because, you know, they're kind of looking for me. Maybe they're... You know what? Maybe I'm kind of wanting to uh, do the manual reload again. And this time... I want to do it without being seen, but I still want to use the coconut, kind of. <laughs> well, I missed the look. Like, I'm starting to understand why people are so serious about you even picking up a letter opener knowing what people can apparently do with it. Like, Tom Brady couldn't hope to throw something with that level of velocity. And it doesn't matter how old you get or the games you play, hitting someone with a coconut will always be funny. Funny thing is, I don't even have to do it here. But I want to pick up the coconut first, at least. I'm sure he'll get, like, pissy if you take too long, but... Oh, it's a joint. Okay. Okay, so I can just have it on my person. Don't mind me looking through my pockets. I'm getting a bad feeling here. Wait for me here. I'll be back as soon as possible. All right, whatever it is, better be good. It's not letting me use it. You know what? You're not going to play along. That's it. I want to see how far I can throw this thing. Ah. Uh. <laughs> yes, that's it. Now Ingram trusts you. It's like shooting fish in a barrel. I don't know how to save everything else. Sweet dreams, my prince. All right, back to where we were. <laughs> Wait, what's this? Oh, I can conceal something. Can I not bring a joint up with me? God, I swear to God, if I have to go through customs again, and they frisk me, and they, like, get pissy because I have a coconut, I'm actually going to flip shit. I don't even have the coconut anymore. It broke. I gotta remember. Yeah, I gotta go. Okay, I gotta go this way. That's right. Okay, so I can run. I don't have to walk everywhere. I was kind of worried. Oh. oh, they're not going to do it again. Okay. They trust me even though, you know, I, I went back down. Poison. Missing poison. <laughs> Honestly, it's your fault. Oh. Well, that makes me want to immediately start panicking. Why would you say that to me? You have the picture. Yes, 
here. Good. Our guest will be delighted. Please follow him. He's waiting. Looking right good, this way, Looking Mr. Good. Thank you, sir. I like you better than that guy. That guy was rude. Can I take the apple? Oh, How thank God I didn't get arrested for taking the apple. I apologize about the incident earlier downstairs. But you have to understand that we need to keep security tight, no matter who. All our guests go through the same procedure. Oh, I like it up here. This looks pretty cool. They definitely made uh, all the areas you go through look really nice. I appreciate that. I also hate how like my walking speed is faster than hers, so I have to keep like walking forward. Yeah, it's... Mm. He's gonna like all the filters I put on my photograph. You can even see the, the broken coconut in the picture. I don't know why there was a coconut just sitting there next to a joint, but you know what? I'm not going to ask too many questions. Can I pull the fire alarm? <laughs> I can pull the fire alarm. <laughs> Again, you know, letting the intrusive thoughts win. I'm sorry, ma'am. Can we go a little faster? That is true, but that's also a terrible thing to think about. But <laughs> pulling the fire alarm and then opening fire. Ah, I see you have a hoover. That's Carl Ingram, Providence partner and brass ball billionaire. A legendary political fixer, Ingram is old money and as rotten as they come. What is she doing? No, sir. Yes. Your problem is fixed. <laughs> Omar said you were good. Let's get down to the important business at hand. Okay, people, clear the room. Hey! Some delicate business with Mr. Kazim. Great idea. We have Ingram right where we want him. Excuse me for a second. What he said, you know home. what to do. Have a drink to see the view. It's something to behold. I uh, you see you're playing solitaire. Do you now? Can I not do anything to this guy? Why is this so hard? <laughs> Where did it put me? Okay, just right here. God damn, man. I'm so glad there are auto saves. But I was trying to subdue that guy so that I could, uh, so I could kill. Alright, let me think here. What do I have in my inventory? Mind if I have a snack? Hey, I got the right idea. I like where my head's in the right place. I think <laughs> I came here without my. I, I knocked a dude out by throwing an apple in his face. This dude is strong. Now I wonder if I don't take this opportunity, what happens? I should probably save just in case it overwrites it again. So. Like, if I wait, will it right. Where were we? Ah, get more information. My man here will stay for me. I assume that will not be a problem. Either way, you have no choice in the matter. It's interesting we have not come across each other before, Mr. Kazim. Well, maybe not. I usually have my people talk to people like you i can imagine i don't know how much omar i mean the royal highness has told you 
but my guess is very little, so let me get straight to the point. My organization has been hit by an unpleasant cancer. Good idea. Oh, where was I? I don't know how much Omar I need. So I could have poisoned that at some point? Has told you, but my guess is very little, so let me get straight to the point. My organization has been hit by an unpleasant cancer that can only be removed by cutting it out of the gut. Don't you get my drift? Yes, I do. Good. This little turd is... <laughs> this little turd? Is he 13? Cells, and I want him stopped. Brutally. Chemo won't remove him. Only the knife. I have his file here. Arthur Edwards. A sly little devil if there ever was one. Me and my associates, well, we underestimated the little worm. We want revenge. I think you and I share a common interest. I doubt that. But I want you to make him suffer. Hmm. This is not a horse that needs to be put out of its misery. This is a rabid dog that needs to be put down. Well, when you put it that way. Am I making myself clear, Mr. Kazim? Yes. Consider it done. Good. We're now in business. We are. I'll have Miss Toe send you anything you need. So this keeps We're moving done. forward. Oh, well. One last question. I'm just curious. You're nicknamed the Vulture. Why? I find it's best to wait for the perfect kill. Ah. Uh, you'll be perfect for the job. Very foreboding. Nice to meet you, Mr. Kazim. I look forward to receiving safe hunting. Guard! Yes, Mr. Ingram? Please show Mr. Kazim out. Yes, sir. Mr. Kazim, please follow me. Alright, so... Did I... I hope I didn't give up my only chance to kill him there. I probably didn't. I'm assuming that if I keep going through with this, I'll make something work. Unless I just threw away my only effort. Because they did leave for a split second, but... Can you move a little faster, sir? Come on. Oh. Okay. Didn't mean to brush against you. Now that would have been an opportunity to kill him, but I think we can do better. Hmm. Mr. Kazem, you need to listen to me. Follow me and don't get sidetracked. Well, yeah. Is there anything else I can do for you? Oh, what? We're going back. We're going back. You're and I don't do shots. Okay. Okay. Man, it's like walking a tightrope with these people. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to load back in. And this guy is going to go to the Shadow Realm, because I do not think there's anything I could do after that. I think I'm giving up my opportunity. Mr. Kazem, you need to listen to me. Follow me, and don't get sidetracked. Huh? Oh, well, here, load. Yeah, this one right here is what I want.
So does time stop when I open my inventory? Damn it. Ah, uh, he doesn't stay uh, down for very long, does he? So what do I do here? Is there a way to poison his drink from this point? Or did I miss my opportunity? Did I have to, like, find poison somewhere? Oh, I had to knock him out. Try again. But that guy, the, the other guys will always see me though, right? So how do I, I want to knock the other dude out quietly while he has his back turned. And then go after the kill. Yeah. Yeah, that doesn't work either. So what am I missing? Is there anything that I should have brought with me here? A big issue is that I'm kind of out of time, right? If, if, like, he'll turn eventually. I guess if I wanted to do things in a sloppy way. Alright, what do I got? I have plenty of non-lethal options, but damn. Hi there, friend. I'm sorry about that. Now where were we? Now I know. My man, Don't mind that. What the hell do you think you're doing? I'm not doing anything. Anyway, you have no choice in the matter. Yeah, I have if I want to poison it, I'm missing it, and I would have to do it before he could see me. It's interesting we haven't come across each other before, Mr. Kazim. Well, maybe not. I usually have my people talk to people like you. I can imagine. I don't know how much Omar... Uh, hmm. ...the Royal Highness has told you. Right. My guess is very little, so let me get straight to the point. So I got an idea, I got an idea. Alright, we go back to this. Let's see if this works out. There we go. Should probably drop this though, huh? I found his weakness, guys. Bullets. Oh god damn it, now someone else is involved. All right, we do good here. Anyone else? This is going to be a lot of work. Oh, we got another one. Anyone else? Come on, where are you? Okay, forget it. Ah, time out. Ah. <laughs> it's gonna wow that that does spiral out of control very quickly oh i'm on professional difficulty for one thing that doesn't really help i also like how it let me subdue that guy like what happened there
God damn. Look, there's got to be a way for me to do this without completely massacring everybody that's in the building. If it wasn't for this asshole. Can I offer you a joint, sir? Yeah. My god. It's a good thing I have these time powers to help me. Alright, so let's think here, let's think here. God, I wish I could just... Like, all I can think of is the fiber wire, man. Yeah, it just does this. Is there no way to do a, uh, a tactical takedown? There's gotta be something. Like, I have it in my inventory, right? No, even if I mash it, it doesn't do anything. Oh, this guy has a silence pistol? Oh my god, that works. Because he had a, I didn't know he had a silenced weapon. Okay, well, you know what? And I can conceal it, too. Perfect. I'll stay as myself here. Oh. Sir, did you see something you shouldn't have? Okay. Ooh, nice place. Ah, <laughs> uh, they might, but I'll be out of here. Oh god. I forgot that I have to have an exit. <laughs> Without an exit strategy, I'm kind of screwed, aren't I? Oh, are they going to frisk me? They aren't. No, it's at the bottom that they do that, and I'm coming out, so it shouldn't be an issue. Evening, gentlemen. You know, I might go for a jog this time, actually. No reason. Alright, now who's the other guy? He's all the way over there, cool. But now that I have a silenced pistol, this should be a little easier, right? No reason for him to frisk me going down, so... Alright. So this guy... He's towards the other end of the skyscraper. Now I wonder how long it'll take for them to find the bodies. Maybe if I do this hey, quickly. Listen here, pal. I'm sorry. But you're not getting through. Uh huh. Well, I know how somebody who might. Okay, maybe not because they're surrounded. Uh, where's a guard I can knock out? I got this guy. If you're still unconscious at this point, I think you're just dead. I could almost give him his clothes back. <laughs> oh, I didn't mean to put that there. I don't mean to pull it out. No coconut. Of course, he's still there, too. Those guys are all talking to each other. There's no way I can execute without somebody seeing me here. 
So, I have to find a way to either segregate a guard, or... Hmm. Is this a staff-only door? Oh, it's a toilet. Hello there, sir. Hello. Shall you be shitting today, or pissing? Or dare I say both? I can overflow the sink. Oh, that would probably get their attention, right? Do you think the bellhop is allowed in? Hey, you. Is this your what? What's wrong? What's wrong? You're gonna get in trouble, mister. I'm not. <laughs> Can I knock her out? Whew. Great. Glad we got that taken care of. Damn, this guy is hairy. Gotta give him credit, though. He had some pretty good perception to assume that the moment I uh, started overflowing the sink, this guy is an assassin. 100%. Great. Really hope nobody has to use the bathroom. Or has to go see Ingram. Might not be as overt as I was hoping. I'm on break. Alright, I'm staff now, so they should let me behind. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so that worked. Can I grab a snack? No? Whatever. So, we're, okay, where is this guy? Am I even in the right area? Oh, I can power this place out. Okay. Oh, that could draw his attention. Okay, so here's something else here. They knew from the new guard of planet codename Pinky. I got word that he entered the building, but he isn't reported for duty yet. Probably still. Hi. Hey, you! This is a restricted area! Yes. Oh, they're searching for me? Oh, what? Who's there? Oh, my God. Oh, this is getting out of hand real quick. Anyone see that guy? Hey, you see him? You see what happened there? Why am I missing so hard? Some kind of maniac is in here, man. It's crazy. Come on, we're not gonna lose this guy. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't see that there was a witness. Oh, the newest one is when they're just letting me in. God damn it. So, I mean, hindsight's twenty twenty, but since we went back in time, it's officially supposed to get built around killing everything. Better be a passive hit. <laughs> Better kill everyone. Look, sometimes things happen, alright? <laughs> okay, I see. Uh, so what I gotta... Oh, I can pick up a screwdriver. Alright. 
I need a wrench for that. I thought, oh, God damn it, I had a wrench not too long ago. But I put it down. Well, that was in the other mission, I suppose, but damn. What I really need here is I need a security guard if I want to get into that room. But I guess I don't really have to go into that room either. Oh, we're back here. Well, then I guess I don't need it. He's just walking around. Looking good. Looking good. Thank you, sir. Alright, let's just follow him. There he is. Ah, he's got a personal guard. Standing right here, sir. Please step out of my bubble. Excuse me. The night replacement job isn't up yet. We know he's arrived. I'm sure he's just changing into his uniform. And he'll be here very soon. Good. Remember to check his papers before you call me. I don't want some snot nosed newbie. I'll call you as soon as he turns up. You better. All right, we'll follow this guy. You weren't supposed to see that. <laughs> Look, I have to try. I have to try. He's just standing there. And that's still... Oh my god, it's going to make me do this shit again. God damn it. Oh, dude, this Marcus guy is in plain sight. I know, I got to trick him and shit, but like... So it was a waste of time to kill the dude and then choke out the lady. Can I subdue this guy without making noise? Ah, hey, uh, almost. I'm a good assassin. All right, we are getting through this if it kills me. <laughs> My team is lukewarm. Ah, uh, well, uh, you find someone who gives a shit. I don't know. Oh, I know where the screwdriver is. Alright, so I just gotta find one guy who's out in the open. I can go into staff-only areas, I just can't go into, uh... Okay, this guy right here? He looks a little lonely. Ah, but her though. Oh, <laughs> uh, where can I hide these guys? I know I can hide at least one of them in the thing back there. I also didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to unholster my weapon. I kind of forgot the controls a little bit. But it all works out. Kill the people who have weapons on them. Knock out the people who I don't have to. I'll go get you a friend real quick. Don't want that weapon there. I'll try to be gentle. There we go, you two have fun.
All right, so now I should be able to get in there and get information without them uh, being concerned. Oh, we're we're right here just in time. Iverson is expecting a replacement guard. If you can locate him, we should be able to get within strangling distance of the living room. <laughs> Perfect. Well. Alright, so I was in the staff area, wasn't I? Or is it down? I have to go below now? Man, it's a good thing that nothing happened here. Although I think the oil is leaking from that Dr. Pop machine. Where is this missing recruit? When he said that to locate the missing recruit, I thought he meant disguise myself. Look, this is gonna make me look really bad. I'm sure it's around here somewhere. Don't you worry. A colleague is also out there looking. But this is awful. I mean, I'm in my boxers and you are a woman. It's just so embarrassing. Oh, it's nothing I haven't seen before. But you don't mm. understand. I'm military. We military men are used to punctuality. I I was supposed to be ready and present my papers half an hour ago. Yes, you men in the army with your papers, super punctual. I get it. I need her to leave and. Fun of me? That's so cruel. Do you do you know what a man is without his gun? <laughs> man in his boxers, crying like a baby. Ugh, you women will never understand. <laughs> and I don't think we ever will. Hmm. I have a problem. What's I'm a... supposed to meet up for duty, but they can't find my uniform. That's not my problem. Come on, I need help. You look my size. If, if you're off duty, couldn't I just borrow your uniform? It's my first day and I really need this gig. Good for you. Congratulations. No, it's all screwed up. They can't find my uniform. I'm begging you. Man to man. Sorry. Still on duty. Oh, God. This is not my day. Oh, it's Mumbai all over. Can't I just go in your place, wink, wink, nudge, nudge? I can't find it. Can't you just wear a waiter uniform? It's pretty effective if you wanted to blend in. Nice. What? Are you trying to be my mother? My God, no! I need. To I, I actually kind of sympathize with this guy. Do you not understand that? Okay, I'll keep looking. Thank you. All right. All right, I think we got your situation figured out. All right, now which one of these lockers look like I could drag you into it? Can I put you in the heap of uh, clothes? No. <laughs> okay, I was about to say, is that a window? I was really confused for a second. Uh, is there nowhere I can hide the bodies? Well, definitely not. Oh, there's a camper here. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. I'll put him in there. Okay, yeah, but look. I, I didn't kill the dude because I sympathize with him, all right? And he's going to get a nap on his first day. This is a pretty good excuse to why he didn't show up, that a master assassin knocked him out and hit his body. Great. Great. We're in business. Whew. All right, so how do I get to the security office? I had to go, oh, I had to go back to the, I mean, I was already in the office though. They're, are they not gonna recognize me? 
They're asking before you start on day one, you don't get a day two. Okay, but that's like saying, like, oh, on my way to my first day of boxing practice, Mike Tyson showed up and just, like, slugged me, man. Does that mean I'm fired? I think you'd have to be a pretty asshole boss to, like, not kind of see eye-to-eye -eye with people there. Can I? No? Yeah, that's a good point, too. See, I'm just sticking my neck out for this guy. Now, if he was rude to me, he'd probably have some lead between his eyes. Hello, I'm here for work. Reporting for duty. About time. Our client has been going out of his mind waiting for you. Do you have the papers? Yes. Good. I'll call him now. How should I address him? It's classified. So, you don't call him anything. Got it. Officially, he's just known as codename Pinky. Huh. Did he choose that himself? Sir, this is security. Just calling to let you know your new guard has finally arrived. Yes, sir. See you soon. You need to back off. Whoa, I thought this was my job. Oh, what kind of escort? I have very high standards. I trust you will do your duty. You have your credentials on you? I should just walk up and just fucking punch him. <laughs> Those are my credentials. <laughs> oh my god, you you knew that was gonna be a thing, a cutlery. <laughs> Well, yeah, I think I know a thing or two about a uh, letter opener, so maybe now I'm finally allowed to touch it without being assaulted and murdered. I expect you to be by my side 24-7. More like... As I say otherwise. Bathroom breaks are, of course, permitted, but only when I say so. I have a very important, delicate meeting today, in which I expect you to keep your ears closed, but your eyes wide open. Understood? Now, your papers were indeed impressive. <laughs> grew to appreciate what it takes to gut an animal. Have you ever tried to gut an animal? Yes. Good. Then you know it's not so easy as it looks. <laughs> I always love the situational irony in, like, everything 47 says, right? Like, he doesn't understand it, but, like, as the player, you're like, oh, I see the double meaning. Yeah, that sounds reasonable. Alright. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Hey, what are you doing, man? It wasn't that what I was supposed to do? You need to find an exit. A business. Eh, oh well. But it's far from over. You've gained his trust. What to do with all that power? Uh, well, I killed him. I don't think he trusts me anymore. Well, there. You <laughs> Look, he didn't say where the targets were. All right.
<laughs> yeah, I can definitely see why going through all those would be so fun. Wow, that's a lot of XP. Flexible murderer. That's a way to put it. Oh, I only got a one star for that? Come on. All right, we're going to do that one again, but this time we're going to get higher than one star. Oh, I can, I can, all right, I have some. Okay. So I got to, uh, I'll, I'll do one more run through of it really quickly just because I want to, uh, I don't want to casual. So why would targets blow things up and take chances? It's about making a general mess, running and hide and see what happens, and doing it all over again. What's professional? Unlimited, oh. So Master is the only one that gives you less saves. All mission story guides available. Surveillance cameras active. Oh yeah, okay. Challenging with her. I like that, I like that. Like, I don't know why it says, like, I can open up a smuggled item now, but it tells me this is already in use. I can choose a start. Can I choose a different one? Okay, I can start at different areas. Oh, with a different disguise, too. Okay, okay. So there is a little bit for that as well. I still don't know what that's all about. Distract coins are a distraction. Okay, so I can bring the concealed weapon with me now. Okay, so that's a little better. Oh, I can change the way I look. Why not just a signature shoot? Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's see what this gets me. Well, now it makes more sense for them to pat me down because I actually concealed a weapon on me. All right, where are they? Where are they? Where's the little second guy? Oh, there he is. That was easy. Huh, well, you know, they did a really good job of uh of keeping me out. Oh, please tell me he shows. Hit the deck, everyone. <laughs> There has to be a way for me to escape that, right? For me to kill him and then just, like, blend back in. Yeah, why go through all the politics and everything when I can just kill the dude? Oh yeah, it shows on my minimap where exactly they're at, so. Welcome. No worries, I just gotta use the bathroom. This, dude, I'm telling you, there's gotta be a way. I, it would be so funny. So we know the other guy's up there, right? So 
If that's the case... Can I, like... Will he still be, like, looking at the balcony? Like, I hope he doesn't, like, by the time I walk to the other dude, he doesn't, uh, leave the balcony there. Oh. How wonderful! You know, I didn't think you'd come after your tragic loss. Thank you, Lucian. I would love to chat, but Marcus Stuyvesant will have gone to see his brother's artist. Him and the school. I'm almost okay. So it looks like he's not going to be at the balcony for much longer. I'm getting closer, home slice. Just on the other. I wish I could like wall bang him. Yeah, damn. I'm guessing he's outside of here now. And I just missed him. But no problem. Come with me. Right behind me. You got him, 47. Marcus Stuyvesant won't be a problem anymore. <laughs> Let's move on to Carl Ingram. Who could have done this? Ma'am. I know I don't mind if I use this, right? Oh, perfect. He'll come to me. Do I have anything that I can throw? Just a coin, which isn't really... Might have to go lethal here. I don't think women's clothes typically fit. These guys don't even check on me. Okay. Does anyone have a... Oh, can I go up here? I can. Ugh, where is everybody? No one wants to isolate these days, man. Okay, well, there's not much reason to be up here, then. Ugh, I just need something that'll, like, not draw suspicion of me being here. Are those both... No, that is that... Are they both girls there? That looks like it might be a guy. Alright, we'll try this. That's the idea, isn't it? What do you no! oh! Yeah, I can't take her clothing. Not really my size, is it? Okay. I fell for the old coin trick, as it would be. Oh, 
Uh oh. Man, I would be careful if I was you. Back to the snap, My bad. D don't mind me. She 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 has a vertigo. Oh my god. Now this guy is involved. Ah, for fuck's sake. Alright, alright, alright. Alright, where were we? Right. Ooh. They just forgot about me, I guess. Now he's probably getting note that someone was killed, uh, the VIP was killed, so now he's gonna be on lockdown and. Back to trespassing. It's not me. Ugh, I think we gotta call it. <laughs> I'm getting a little too lazy. We'll definitely play this again, especially with the other uh, missions. Ugh. So it was fun though for just a little bit. As I mentioned, we're doing a uh, a very long 12-hour stream coming up pretty soon. So that'll be fun when we finally get to it. Probably won't do the uh, thing with the face rigging again because it looks like it doesn't work very well. But I do have to say thank you so much, everybody, for uh, stopping by if you did, and have a great night.